Now, a study out this year shows prescription drug overdoses kill more people than heroin or cocaine combined. And drug-related deaths doubled in the United States over the last decade. News 10's Patsy Kelly talked to many local recovering addicts who say it is a problem. But I got tired of spending my every waking moment trying to find that fix. Leslie has been an addict since she was a teen. She's just one of numerous recovering addicts we spoke to today. Jeremy battled the RX bottle for 20 years. My family had to cut me off. Um, I was lying, stealing, um, robbing, didn't care. Whatever I had to do to get my drugs, that's, that's what I, I did. Both consumed with finding their next prescription drug fix. Leslie says she would go doctor shopping. She'd visit three to four doctors to get three to four prescriptions to feed her addiction. The use of painkillers has quadrupled in the past decade. That's according to the Centers for Disease Control. It reports doctors write about 300 million pain med prescriptions a year. That's enough for each adult in America to be medicated for a month, 24 hours a day. Police say prescription drugs are considered the most abused drug. They say more kids are experimenting with prescriptions because they're easier to get and they're legal. Leslie says finally she couldn't take her addiction any longer. And finally, I just got to the point where I could not take it any longer. It was either I did something about it or I was going to die. But both Leslie and Jeremy said there's always hope for an addict. Because sometimes I don't even think about reaching over and grabbing that pill bottle now. And that's something that I thought would never happen, ever. In Terre Haute with photojournalist Cody Murphy, Patsy Kelly, News 10. Well, good for them for speaking out.